Hello everybody. I've started to get serious about the idea of low weight carriers because the weight is really what slows the carriers down. And I found that there are a large number of things you can do to reduce weight while still looking great and being great. The first thing you can do is you can cut batteries out of your diet. Those are far, far less effective than I thought they were. So just no more batteries for me. The second thing you can do, and this is quite odd, well, obviously, if you plan to use engines, you should stick to large engines, and you should arrange them so they take up as little scaffolding and, and cladding as possible. But you have another option. You can go large engine-less. You can go large ship engine-free, like this. Believe it or not, these eight engines are almost exactly the same uh, thrust as that one heavy engine. Now let me put that heavy engine back in, just so you can see the difference in size here. So those eight and this, the same thrust within a couple of, it's, it's, not, it's, it's not, significantly, not significantly less. They take up less space. Yes, they also take up less kilograms. They weigh less than 14% as much. I think it's something like 13.5%. Uh, and even with the added requirement of a rotor and some legs, they still weigh far, far less. Uh, the down, oh, they also use less electricity. They're more efficient per kilonewton with electricity. So I, um, I do think there are a couple of downsides. One of the downsides is that the ship will uh, have a lot more parts to it, and that part count will make your speed a little bit slower. And the other downside that I'm working with, I'm going to try and figure out if I can fix it or not, it looks like it causes phantom torque. Um, so I might have to try and work out how to get rid of phantom torque, and maybe what I'll do is I'll use like connector blocks and stuff or something instead of instead of these. Um, but the phantom torque is what's causing this to to move. It's spinning. I don't know if you at the beginning the sun was directly on top of the engine and now it's significantly off to the side. Yeah, so that phantom torque will cause your ship to rotate even if you have inertial dampeners on. So there's something screwy with that, and uh, don't know what that is. If you happen to know more about phantom torque, let me know. Otherwise, um, I'll just fuddle through on my own. But I thought you might like to see that this is the same. The same thrust. So I might go with small ship engines for my light carrier.